Hello and welcome to this Construct 2 tutorial. Uh, originally I wasn't going to do this tutorial and you'll notice that in part 2 when I say I was going to demonstrate it to you live. Um, however I thought this would be the easy way in the end so when I rattle on in part 2 you'll just ignore me. Um, now this is a tutorial on how to set up a tile map in Construct 2 and create a level. Now you're not going to expect any great level design or art stuff from me that is not my speciality. I'm more of a programmer, um, and I'm terrible at arts, like completely terrible. Um, one of the stories I like to say is when I was doing concept art at university, my concept art tutor said this, and I quote, "Everyone can draw until I met you." So that's nice. But there we go. I do not cry over spilt milk. Unless it's milkshake, then I will cry at that. Okay, so I'm going to set up the window size first. I'm going to do it about a thousand by six hundred, so a thousand height, six hundred width, and this will be the area in which we can see. Okay then. So next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to add in a tile map. So to do that, double click and come to this option called tile map. I'm just going to call this level map. There we go. Click anywhere. Now, before I load my image in, you actually want to find a tile map. So to do this, you can either do it a couple of ways. Either create your own tile map, or use free resources that people put online. A good website to use is opengameart.org. You can see, find loads of different options down here for 2D art. So you just go to browse 2D art, there's loads. There's other places you can go to as well, like Sprite Resource, but I quite like Open Game Art. So I will be using that one. So I've already picked mine, so I'm just going to load it in. Wherever I put it, I can't remember. I believe it's this one. Yes, it's this one. So I shall just load that in, and there it is. So next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to just set my tile width and tile height to 16. I'm going to come up here to view. I'm going to snap to grid and share grid and change the width and the height of the grid to match my tile width and tile height. So first of all, I'm just going to put my background into place like so. It's just going to be all over in the background. Get a little bit, oh, I was getting a little bit carried away there. Still. So, just going to make sure it stays in my window height. Uh, as you can tell, I'm, I'm not the most coordinated person in the world, but I can sort that out in a second. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. So our background will nearly be there in a second, or my background will. As I said, the point of this is just to show you how tile maps are set up. So I'm not going to spend ages getting this looking like a Picasso painting. Your levels will look superior to mine in every way. Because I am terrible at this. And I also have the worst mouse name to man. Uh. So I'm nearly there setting up how I want it. Uh, so close. There we go. And I'm just going to rub out some of these excess ones like this. Making sure that I don't rub out the ones that I do need.
and there we go Ooh. try not to roll the ones I do need and I go and do that anyway so go back in there we go okay so this is essentially is going to be my background layer so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to lock this layer like that so if find layers just find this section that says layers and I'm going to right click I'm going to click add new layer which I'll just click the plus sign here okay and in this layer we want to create a copy of our tile map so to do this we shall come into our projects click level map and click clone I'm just going to drag and drop our new one onto this so there's our old one here's our new one I'm going to make sure it's in the right place make sure that we're on the correct layer yep and I'm going to change it to be same width and same height like so and now I'm going to start creating my map essentially so I'm going to come in here and I'm just going to create a small level So it can be, it can look however you want it to look like. So mine's not going to look great. No one has to tell me that one. <clears throat> do, do, do. I'm going to rub that bit out actually. And come back in here let's grab that bring that down yeah. not getting the way I want it at the minute Do, do. It looks a bit terrible to me at the moment. Let me add something the other way, like this. Oh, and the wrong tool. So if I come down like that. I don't even know what I'm doing at the moment so you just have to bear with me let's try something like this let's get the layout how I want it so well that's not looking right That's more like it. Oops, going a bit overboard there. There we go. And grab more of this black area. So, oopsie daisy. Come here again. there Come 
definitely more at the bottom here. Actually, just grab another one off there like that. And that looks okay for me. I'm not really going to spend just grab one of them. It's okay. I'm gonna put a platform down at the bottom here. It's just going to look like oops. It's going to look like this. Actually no, it's going to look like this. I'm going to add, you can add a few details as well, you can add these spikes just at the top, if you can, oh they're really small there, <clears throat> so what you can do is add more different types of sprites as well to give you level some more details, so I'll just show an example, so if I click on sprite, <clears throat> click torch, Click insert if oh construct tools seems to have crashed on me. Click up oh. now. Come back. <laughs> I'll try and give it a minute to kick in. If not, I will probably call it there. Oh, oh, looks like it stopped. Anyway. I'm not going to re-record re this vid, all I wanted to show you was how to put in a tile map into Construct 2 anyway. Um, I apologise for my lack of art and level design credentials, it is definitely not my area. Um, also key things I wanted to show you was how to add a sprite in, which I wasn't able to do, but the same way you added a tile map in would be the same way how you add your custom sprite in. We also looked into how to create a different layer as well so I'm guaranteed that you'll create better looking levels than I will and I'll try and help answer as many questions as I can so I hope this helped um, and I'll see you next time